Bell County is getting its second solar farm out near Heidenheimer. It's expected to bring with it hundreds of jobs and millions of dollars to the city. But what is the benefit for those who call the area home and what's the cost? Six News reporter Barry Roy has the story for us tonight. The, the county's involvement has been through this uh, payment in lieu of tax agreement. The Chillingham Solar Farm is coming to Bell County and it's bringing with it some stability. We estimate that through this payment in lieu of tax uh, agreement that the project will bring anywhere from uh, 2.3 to, to 3.1 million dollars in tax revenue. Build with fl uh, flip phone type technology. Residents of the Bell County Commissioner's meeting asked the county to consider the future uh, impacts of such a farm. This project seems to be moving very quickly. Please make a considered open discussion decision that would be best for all the residents of the county. Stafford says the concerns were heard, but the county has no jurisdiction over sales from private sellers to private companies. And because Texas counties don't have the, the ability to zone uh, an area and say, uh, this is agriculture, this is not, um, the, the, the county really can't do anything to, to to stop a project like this from taking place. And Stafford so, says the project will not cost taxpayers any money at all, but what about those who suffered through winter storm Uri? Is solar energy the answer? In a statement to Six News, 8 Minute Solar Energy, the developer of the Chillingham Solar Farm said in part, the efficiency of solar panels increases in cold weather and that they are far less susceptible to mechanical issues that can cause other resources to fail. In Bell County, Barry Roy, Six News. And the solar farm is expected to be completed and fully operational by the end of 2023.